we do look inward onto the group or into the group. We always start by connecting with the people. And this could be those in the community, those in the group, those just involved in our mission. We start by building relationships in order to identify the issues. And once we connect with these people involved, we can plan on how to support and sustain the group and build collective power. And then organizers and their group carry out the action. Mm. Organizers use similar tactics to the other four roles that we talk about. But throughout this whole cycle, it's very important to reflect and evaluate so we don't lose sight of the group vision. The thing that I appreciate most about and I understand the most about the organizer model is that the organizer is not a leader in a traditional hierarchical sense, but more like a facilitator. Am I, am I getting that right? Exactly. You're right on point. Organizers use relational and collaborative spaces. They don't just lead all alone. 